Hey YouTube, it's Dragon Twenty Eight Thirty One, and as usual. Okay, so last time, <coughs> last time we beat its raining seed, so now we're going on to be Gould. Now, this mini game is probably one of the easier ones. Click and drag plants to make matches of three. Save up sun to upgrade your plants. Let's see, here we go. Make 75 matches to pass the level. Yeah, this is all you gotta do. Your plants do the work, and you gotta just shift, shuffle, shift them around a lot. <coughs> so again, like I, like you probably heard in my last video, this is pretty much just a big old parody of Bejeweled. Heck, even the name's a parody of it. Now, you don't have to have your plants upgraded before you beat the before you beat the um game. Not a requirement, thank goodness. But the yeah, not really much to talk about for this one. Now the maximum matching that you can do I think it's like um five or something like that. I think I haven't played this in a while. Yeah, if only I had a star fruit right there, then I could just switch it down there and get a six. Yeah, I think six is the most. And there's also another version of this one that we're gonna be playing later, once we actually unlock it, called um Be Gould Twist. We're pretty much well. First off, if you ever played Bejeweled Twist, then you already know what it is. <coughs> yeah, I'm still coughing. Leave me though. I'm trying to get over this cough as soon as I can, because. Because I mean, that guy, this cough does get annoying. But you want to hear something weird? You know those Halls Cool Breezers cough drops? Yeah. Those are the kind I usually use whenever, like, I'm, whenever I'm coughing like this. I mean, who doesn't? But, but for some weird reason, all the stores me and my mom keep going to, we just can't seem to find them anywhere. I mean, no one has them. We've checked uh, Walmart, we've checked, like, uh, Giant, nothing. They've either got the triple strength, which is the kind I can't really handle. Oh, wait, no, we just beat this thing. That took about three minutes. Wow. So, we're gonna continue. And anyways, um, uh, uh, I mean, like, we've been checking everywhere just for those Halls, Cool Breezers, Cough Drops. Those are the only kind that I can handle. The triple strength and the minty, um, scented. Yeah, I can't handle those. Yeah, I'm gonna continue on since that one only took, like, three minutes. Really short mini game. Now, Invisigool, this one's kind of annoying. Why? Because you can't see the zombies. You have to hope you know that your plants can, uh, you put your plants in the right spot. Zombies are completely invisible. Now, the only way you can even tell where they are is from these little impact shots that your plants are doing. Or if you were to use an ice room or a kernel pult, which, thank goodness, you get in this game. Or if you see him munching on your walnut. <coughs> Sorry. This many games is possibly one of the weirder ones because you don't actually see the zombies. Sure thing you can hear them and all that stuff, but you don't actually see them coming. Which I find pretty weird. Now... The only plants you'll get in this thing is a, um, are ice shrooms, walnuts, lily pads, and pea shooters. Yeah, it stinks, doesn't it? Yeah, you don't really get any other plants, unfortunately. <coughs> Sorry. Where is it yet? This is literally the only way you can even tell if there's even a zombie on the lane at all. Unless, because well, somehow you have, by some divine miracle, you have a lot of ice rooms just lying around somewhere. 
And also on this one, you actually have to listen to whatever, um, to these impacts. Because, um, each impact on whatever zombie type it is, it's different from the next. Like, this one I hear right now tells me that there is a buckethead zombie about those zombies I just hate. And you also get squashes, too. Oh, wait. And I just remembered something. <sighs> you also get... You also do have to deal with the zomboni in this thing. But thank goodness, you know, you can actually see the zomboni's ice trail. So, you know, that kind of helps you. <coughs> now, my strategy for this... Set up a uh, row of walnuts. Ah, dang, I forgot to put something over here. Set up a row of walnuts and just keep putting pea shooters and kernel pulps everywhere. And I completely forgot about those zombies that show up in the water. Wow. I really had that crazy. Oh, whoa, I gotta put the brakes on this thing here for a minute. So probably there's a uh, bucket head right here. Great. Okay, actually right here, I mean. <sighs> yeah, this thing can be pretty tricky. As long as you hear like a clanging sound, that means you know you got a bucket head on your hands. <coughs> and I think the zombies don't show up until like the next wave or something like that. Or final wave, honestly I forget. Again, I haven't played these mini games too much. I think I've mostly been playing Seeing Stars and that's oh my gosh, it. Okay, so apparently there was a jack of the box zombie right there. Where's feathers? I don't know why they can get so many of these stupid jack of the box zombies, but can someone kill that thing already? Please. Oh, wow. Sorry, I panicked. I, I, I freaked out, I'll admit, I freaked out. Whew. Ah, oh, great. I'm about to lose another walnut, aren't I? Oh my gosh, will you stop it, you stupid... Friggin'... <coughs> Look, none of a zombie. Just die already, please. Oh my gosh, I keep forgetting they also have the stupid little ugh, friggin' the accursed accursed Y'all start to be prepared for that freak. The duck on dolphin zombie. Which, lo and behold, I forgot is also in this thing. Ah. Yeah, now you see how this level sometimes gets really annoying. Yeah, see what I mean? Jeez Louise. And here we go again. Oh, no, you don't. Yeah, always keep a, uh, <coughs> a, oh no, a squash handy in case of one of those stupid zombies show up. Oh, not again already. Oh, 
already I need another squash. Come on, squash, squash, squash! No, you don't. I got it! Ugh. <coughs> yeah, see how annoying this level can get already? This is what, like, the second till. Thank goodness we're almost done with this thing. I count this level as a difficulty probably medium to hard. Just be glad we're able to even see the zombies. Just be glad. Okay? Just be friggin' glad. And I hope I got a squash real quick. No, no, you don't. Little. Alright, where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Come on, show your ugly hide. Show your ugly hide. Here you go. That's what I'm talking about. This is a tough level. Jeez, can y'all stop eating for one minute? Stop eating so much. <sighs> wow. Freaks are munching up a storm here. Thank you. <coughs> Whew. All right, that's invisible finally beaten after a lot of yelling at the after some yelling at the screen. And yes, we get to play Seeing Stars, my favorite next. Okay, so like, I'll see you guys. I'll see you guys next time. And lo and behold, speak of the devil, there's be gold twist. Okay, so next time we get to play one of my favorite mini games, Seeing Stars. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.